Well, our uh, Officer of the Year this year is uh, Officer Ken Bellage. Uh, Officer Bellage has been with us since 2010. Um, I had an opportunity to work with Ken for about a year when he first got hired. We were both stationed together up in Jefferson and Fallon counties at the time. I was an officer then, we were, so we were kind of partners in the same detachment. Um, I put Ken in for the nomination this year, however, I'm not his direct supervisor. His direct supervisor just recently retired. And to try to read, I'll just read his letter of nomination really quick and then have Ken come up. Um, I'd like to congratulate you on your selection as the 2017 Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife Kiwanis Club Officer of the Year. We first met in 2010 when you were assigned to Jefferson County while working with Jefferson County. I had the opportunity to work directly with you as a member of Detachment 8. During this time, you gained a reputation of going above and beyond what was expected. You have consistently exceeded all performance expectations and approach every challenge head on. You have a reputation of overcoming adversity and your positive attitude has made you a success, has made you very successful and difficult assignment without complaint. Your commitment to protecting the fish and wildlife resources of the state and the public we serve are unsurpassed. <clears throat> you have worked hard at developing positive relationships with other agencies within the community to provide the best possible public service. Your dedication and commitment to resource protection is what makes fish and wildlife enforcement unique. You bring a standard of excellence to both the Department of Fish and Wildlife and the enforcement program. You are respected by your peers and are always looking for, looking for ways to bring wildlife poachers to justice. Your willingness to drop whatever you are doing to help the fellow officer is a true testament to your professionalism. Thank you. Thank you. Christina uh, Bolage attend today, and uh, yeah, I couldn't do this job without her support, and I think everybody in law enforcement knows the power of that. So thank you again, and I guess the only other thing I'd say is there's two other officers that work in this community, and I'm just the one here representing those other two officers as well, because they're all deserving of uh, the attention I'm receiving today. So thank you very much. Thank you.